Hey guys, it's Elle and today we're doing a pack with me for summer camp because I'm actually on staff this year so I'll be gone for a month and um, it's kind of overwhelming having to pack for a month but thankfully I get to do laundry so I don't have to bring like a ton of clothes. So let me like show you like kind of like my thought process and where we're starting. So here are like the t-shirts I want to bring and like the shorts and skirts, which is like everyday stuff. And my thoughts, like normally I make like outfits because I can't do laundry, but I can do laundry. So I'm not really going to make outfits. I am, however, going to store everything in these drawers. So I'm going to do like color code them. But here are the shirts I'm thinking about taking, just like some like a white plain tee. And then a bunch of just like graphic. These are like my casual, just like everyday um, t-shirts. Very basic, just like comfy, you know, kind of the vibe. See, like there's just, I'm literally, y'all are probably like, girl, you're bringing too many, but, um, I felt like, you know, I don't know how many I'm bringing, but and then I just have a bunch of different like shorts and stuff. So I have 17 shirts right now for like every day, but like, I think that's not too many. I might change my mind once I start packing, but I'm just going to try to fold everything and put it into like my shelves. I think that's like my first order business and do like color coding. So I kind of like have an idea. So like when I want to put it together an outfit every day, it's like easy and I can see it by like color because I was trying to plan outfits, but it was too complicated. And like, I can just like choose what I want at that time. And I think that'll be the easiest. on the most on is workout clothes so I'm gonna bring two pairs of leggings um like a teal one it's black one because like if I want to go lift and I want leggings um I have this swiftly that's like a purple I need to get more swiftly's because a lot of mine are like faded and I don't like and I have a navy one um for tank tops I just have a plain black lulu black and striped and then this cute like tie gray one and for like workout like little like longer cropped tops so i can't just like work out in a bra i have this like black one i have a black aligned tank and then this pink free people and then for like warmer clothes like if it is chilly i do have like just this like loose fit swiftly um, I have a pair of sweatpants I'm going to bring. I have this sweatshirt that I don't care if it gets dirty. Because that's what I was having to think. I need like one. Um, I have like a one cute sweatshirt. And then I have this set. Which is like a cozy but like also short and lightweight. And I can wear this. This like a cute with both of these sweatshirts. I do have my sweatpants. And this goes with these leggings decently well. So I'm kind of trying to think in outfits. Because I was going to try to bring another sweatshirt that went with that. But then I was like, oh, I don't, won't like it to get dirty. And I was going to bring pink leggings. But with like doing like laundry and stuff, I just, I want low maintenance stuff. So this is kind of like what I'm thinking for like warm clothes for early mornings, chill clothes, my days off, and exercise. Because like I work out every day. So that's what I'm kind of just trying to figure out. <laughs> stressing me at the most I'm trying to like find outfits for like the formals kind of we have it camp, like our formal days so this was I was thinking for our second rodeo dance it is cute it's like kind of like big on top because I have like like where my waistline is these aren't always the most flattering dresses on me but I think like this would actually be cute so I'm thinking this and then I need to try my other dress and everything else I know like goes. 
so that'll be nice so this is just like a romper um i'll probably like need to wear like it's really flowy and since like i'm going to church camp and i'm on staff i'm definitely gonna wear like shorts under it but like i think it's cute with like cowboy boots so this would be like my other rodeo dance look so i'll kind of show you like other nice outfits i have so for picture day this year i was just gonna wear like jean shorts with this top one night then this top i might i'll take the yellow one if i change my mind for rodeo itself i was gonna take a red shirt and then like this black one to wear with jean shorts again and then like one of our last nights is fiesta night so i have that zara top and this top to wear with jean shorts okay so i put my nice clothes in a hanging bag i have like things i'm gonna i have my trucks in with me so i can keep some of my truck so in my trunk though i have like vitamins um like fun like costume stuff i have undergarments a bunch of shoes hair toiletries um i have like stationery which i need to zip up my journals my bibles in there my backpack hats like um i got photos to hang up so that's fine my cosmetic bag i'm still i don't leave for camp for basically like half a week but um we're leaving like our house and i'm gonna leave from somewhere else to camp so i'm gonna have to have all that but i'm gonna put that in like a separate bag because i have like packed my other stuff and my shower caddy i'm gonna take oh i do have shower shoes in here which is really important um i have like my snack drawer this is like all like my laundry stuff i have like my t-shirts shorts and workout clothes and then pajamas and sweatshirts in here and i really have everything i need except i have my i need to pack my leather sneakers and then i'm gonna like try to pack all this up and my makeup bag is also gonna go like in another bag because i still have to use that stuff so this is all my bedding stuff, not including my pillow that I have to fit into this double bag or this one. So this is a lot. I'm going to try to fold it strategically and I'll kind of take you through what I have. So I have my mattress pad, sheets. Um, this is like my quilt comforter, like a throw blanket, two bath towels, beach towel, three washcloths, and my laundry bag. So this will be interesting on how I'm going to get all of this. I'm thinking this duffel bag's bigger because this just takes so much room. I'm pretty surprised. I actually got everything in here. I started with my mattress topper on the bottom because it was just so big. And then I did, like layered my bedding on like what will go last. So like the quilt, then like the throw blanket. And then I did the sheets I'm going to put first. And then put my towels on top, put my other pair of sheets in here my laundry basket and washcloths in there. So it all kind of fits. I just have to try to, I think it'll definitely zip, but this will be nice just to have it all in like one bag. Um, so I'm there for a month, so I'll be able to wash stuff. So that's nice, but I'm just trying to get all of my, my bedding in one spot. So I had to get another container. I literally am fleeing to camp right now um, because mine broke when I loaded it to the lake. And I've been at the lake for like half a week. So I got one yesterday, like a new drawer set. But yeah, my car's a mess, but I'm going to camp, guys. So 